giant hogweed, a noxious, invasive plant, was confirmed for the first time in Hamilton County, New York, in the summer of 2013. This plant can threaten the environment and public health and safety. Native to the Caucasus Mountains of Eurasia, giant hogweed arrived in the United States as an impressive ornamental. It was a coveted addition to gardens and arboretum due to its large size and beautiful flowers. Reproducing via seeds and branched taproots, plants escaped their confines, and giant hogweed is now established throughout the Northeast and beyond. Plants prefer habitats with moist, nutrient-rich soils like riparian areas, roadsides, and fields. Due to the plant's large size and rapid reproduction, giant hogweed can outcompete native plants for sunlight, growing space, and nutrients. As invasive plant populations increase, wildlife may lose a food source. Giant hogweed's root structure is shallow and not as effective at holding soil in place as native plants with deeper roots. Giant hogweed is a public health hazard because its sap reacts with sunlight and sweat and may cause blisters, burns, scarring, or even blindness. Obviously, it's, it's an impressive plant. You don't often see a plant growing 15 feet in height. Um, and one that has a, a large, umble-shaped flower like these do, that's definitely red flags. Um, there are a couple native lookalikes to giant hogweed. Uh, Common angelica is one native lookalike, and cow parsnip. The distinguishing factors um, from giant hogweed from those native lookalikes is on the stem you'll see significant red blotching and stiff, coarse white hairs. Giant hogweed was first confirmed in Hamilton County in the village of Speculator. The property owners had been struggling with the invader for years, but the plant always grew back after being cut. We first did not know anything about this plant, how invasive and how dangerous it was. And I thought it was just a beautiful flower. But a few years back, our neighbor's son, son in law came, and he's an expert in this area, and he told us how dangerous it was. And so my husband cut it and um, got down to the roots and also shoveled out the roots. Thought that it was gone, but it's come back bigger. The Hamilton County Soil and Water Conservation District, the Adirondack Park Invasive Plant Program, and the New York State Department of Environmental Conservation teamed up for rapid response. After an indemnity agreement was signed by the property owners, APIP staff managed the giant hogweed plants by first removing the flower heads and then applying an herbicide treatment. The site will be monitored for regrowth. Public awareness and fantastic partnerships allowed this small stand of giant hogweed to be managed quickly and efficiently. If you think you spot giant hogweed in Hamilton County, do not touch the plant. Contact the Hamilton County Soil and Water Conservation District for assistance.